that hurt. Oh, that hurt. We're taking these on the road this time. We're headed to Kentucky Lake. Well, actually, Brandon is right now. I'm gonna leave in the morning. And, uh, oh my goodness. You think you can do this, B? Yeah. All right, so here's what we're doing, guys. We are going to Kentucky Lake, the fabled fishery. Almost the last tour stop. We've got one more after this uh, at St. Clair. So I'm excited. Kentucky Lake, I've been there a bunch. It's always a challenge though, but when you figure them out, it's fun. It's fun, dude. When you figure them out there, yeah. Truck's packed, decks are packed. On top, I mean, it's stupid. But I, that's, hey, all kidding aside, that's what I do love about this thing right here. Is there's plenty of strength on top of this thing. They put like 2,000 pounds on top. Did you know that? 2,000 pounds? That's a lot. I had no idea. What else do we have? We have, oh, I did bring squinchers. Some more squinchers. Because Tom robbed us on our last ones. And uh, that's it. All right, dude. Have fun. It's going to be uh, a little bit of a trip, but you're going to Nashville tonight. You pick me up in the morning. Have fun in Nashville. All right, guys. Bye, truck. Be careful, dude. Be safe, my friend. Be safe. Be safe. Bye-bye now. Bye-bye now. He's one heck of a truck driver, that guy right there. One heck of a truck driver. Just left Scott's, literally. And the first stop I gotta go get, gas. All right, well, we're here at the airport. Hopefully Brandon is, uh, ooh, Las Vegas. That's where he should be going. We're going to Nashville. But Vegas actually looks pretty fun. We do need to go to Vegas. Maybe we'll go out there and go fishing. That'd be kind of sweet. But hopefully Brandon has made it to uh, Nashville. Hopefully uh, all that's good. And uh, time to find my flight. I don't know where my flight is. Because we got to jack them up, boys. We got to jack them up. Looky there, looky there, looky there. Just like that. Leave the airport. We're in Tennessee now. We'll just leave it in there. Brandon, you made it, man. I'm proud of you. You survived the road rage. You survived Nashville. It has some road rage. Yeah, I did see your Instagram stories, and they look like maybe you were up a little late last night. Do we have someone joining us on this one? This is Rob Matsura. Did What's I butcher up? that pretty bad? Uh, a, little a little bit, bit. But we'll get used to it. We'll get used <laughs> to it. He's going to help out a little bit this week, guys. So, it's going to be a fun week. Here's the goal. We need to win the tournament, dude. I fished Kentucky Lake like a bunch, so there's no reason I shouldn't focus to win this tournament. They're gonna be getting out there. We'll find them on little graphs, jack them up. Am I driving? Yeah. All right, next stop, Kentucky Lake. All right, Brandon, we're, we're in this little area now off of uh, off the interstate called Land Between the Lakes. You know why they call it Land Between the Lakes? This is land between the lakes. Exactly. Exactly. It's land that's in between the lakes. Lake Barkley State Park right there. That's cool. Here we go. Look at all the carp. Carp everywhere. Look at them all. Just thousands of carp. Yes. So, we just got a text message from Billy. He said, where are y'all at? He said his ETA was literally like two minutes behind our ETA. Look, there he is right there. What up, mate? What up, mate? We got the band back. Pretty good, huh? Yeah. Come from two different parts of the country. I know. Within like Weird. three minutes of each other. Weird. Yeah. Hey, Brandon. You miss me? Say hi, say hi to Rob. Hey Rob, what's up? Man? <laughs> what's up? Man? Nice to meet you. What's going on? <laughs> you remind me of somebody. I don't know. I need to think about it. <laughs> okay. Oh, by the way, Billy, Billy, Billy is sometimes a little sarcastic. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Probably not good. I don't believe. All right, we're down. All right, follow us. All right, so this is Kentucky Lake right here. This is uh. The bridge that goes across Kentucky Lake. See how wide this thing is, dude? It's huge. And it's all shallow. Like, out here, it's not real deep. Really? Well, I mean, it's like 20 foot deep, 30 foot deep, whatever. But there's 
all these ledges and up, up humps and things that are just everywhere out here. These basket on all this stuff out here in the middle. All right, I'm gonna turn around. All right, all right, all right, bye. So we missed missed a turn, Brandon. That's why you should be driving because when you drive, we just don't ever miss turns. It's much safer for me to be over there, just kind of doing things, right? As much as I hate to agree with you. Sketchy, dude. I'm sketchy. <laughs> You're a terrible driver. <laughs> sketchy. Who's the dude out there in the orange shirt? Yeah, they got a dog. Yes. What's up, man? What's up, baby? You got your, you got your, uh, your bright orange on. How you doing, man? Mike Cox. What's up, man? How are you, sir? Good, good. Good. So it's your new pad. I like it. Yeah, I like it's, it. It's, it's pretty cool, man. We're, we're, we're tickled with it. You're, you're going you're to like it inside. It's, it's pretty sharp. It's going to be the best part of the trip right there. What, the dog? The dog. <laughs> you rolling? You're always rolling. Get you a buddy. happy all week now. Okay. All you gotta do to keep Brandon happy, Rob, is give him coffee and and uh, get him a little animal of some you sort. Yeah. Well, we have a pug in the house. Too. Do you? <laughs> got a pug in there. What? Really? He's got a pug, yeah. <laughs> oh, crap. Look, look, Billy. These are for you. Yes. They're just for you, Billy. He loves these. Nice. He's a candy cat. Look at there. Brandon's got two buddies now. <laughs> Man, that's a fat dog. Man, that's a fat dog. <laughs> I bet they leave the food stall out all the time for you. That shower goes into the tub right here. Like, so if it gets too crowded, I'm like, serious. Like, well, we just take like and community just, showers? Yeah. This is the we just all get in there? Yeah. After Ooh. a long day on the water? Yeah, and of course the glass is not in this side yet. See, Billy, you stay on this side, over here. Put Brandon in the middle and I'll be on the far right. You want me to carry that out for you? Yeah. No, we'll make my constable. We'll make my Is that nothing? Is there a trash can somewhere I'll put it to? No. Why won't you let me get it out? What if I want to? <laughs> you got a bed? Oh, you got a mattress for that one? Yeah, we have, that's what I went in the box for you. The boys are going to bring it up, and we have the... So, anyway. Like the woodwork. Yeah. And then they did that. Yeah. Yeah, the kid. Yeah, the kid. There's yeah, the kid. In, in Indiana Jones? Yeah. yeah. The Temple of Doom. Are you sure not thinking yeah, of that? Yeah, movie star. Let me borrow $10. <laughs> you really can't. No. Are you sure there's not? You were in the Goonies, too, weren't you? Yeah, the Goonies. I know what? there's the Asian... That's what the movie you're talking movie about. movie star. Not in the end it's of a movie star. Huh? Is that your bed, Yes. It's Billy's. Billy's bed. Yeah, this is how we... Y'all be careful with this one. This is how we roll. <laughs> you go. Here, suck on that for a little bit. <laughs> oh, yeah. spider, 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 spider. Back up, back up. Where'd he go? You're doing good, Scott. Come on. Yeah, I'll watch him. I'll probably put him down. You get way over. Come on back and straighten up. It's good, man. Like a glove. Like a glove. That's the thing about bass fishing. Is that bass fishermen don't need much. You know that, right, Mike? Yeah. Bass fishermen. All we need is a boat and a garage for the boat. And that's what we have. First time I get my boat in here, batteries are dead. Brandon. 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 Brandon let the boat fill up with water. Driving here. We plug it in, and of course it's automatic bilge. There's no way. I don't know how to turn the automatic bilge off. It's getting close to quitting. Now it is time to get to work. Preparation is key, especially this time of the year where you have so many different things. Shallow bite, deep bite, I mean there's just spawning fish, post-spawn fish. You gotta have a lot of options ready to go. 
and uh, I like to get everything organized. So it's going to take me a couple hours, literally, to get this boat and get all my rods set up the right way. Packed up, dude. You ready? We got 87 rods rigged up. We have shallow rods, deep rods. We have everything imaginable. Yeah, you know, this is a different Kentucky Lake than it has been the last couple years, just because the carp issue that they're having right now is kind of a kind of change in the way these bass react and, and set up on this lake. So it's a little bit of a learning curve out there tomorrow. But nevertheless, we got a job to do. We need to put uh, a lot of hard work in. That's it, man. We're going to bed. We're going to bed. Thanks for hanging out. And uh, here's what we got coming after this video. Day one of practice, baby. That's right, day one of practice. So check it out, and thank you so much for sharing everything. Billy, Billy, tell them bye. Bye. Bye-bye now. Bye-bye. Bye, Bill. -bye. Bye,